In this episode, we have one goal, just one goal. The goal is to get from Missoula to the Glacier National Park. And then we're just going to come back to Missoula again. A Glacier National Park, we're not sure what will be open and what not will not be open because it's still snow season. In fact, it snowed here in Missoula last night, even though it's June soon, which is summertime in America. The day was nothing short of a roller coaster ride, packed with delightful surprises and, unfortunately, a few unexpected disappointments. But I'll tell you more about them later. For now, be prepared for a different and shorter episode. We had a friend travelling with us on this day, which led to less filming than usual. But that's not all. There is a twist of disappointment, and I'll reveal that later. Our journey north to Glacier National Park was a jaw-dropping experience, especially with the majestic peaks and snow-dusted pines. It looks straight out of a winter wonderland. Here we are in Glacier National Park. This is Lake McDonald. And the water here is so clear. I can't believe how clear it is. And it looks fantastic with the snow on the mountains just behind us here. Upon our arrival, we could only access a small part of going to the Sun Road due to seasonal closures. But we were aware of this limitation during our planning process, so we weren't too worried about that. Nevertheless, we tipped off a top item from our bucket list and visited the Trail of the Cedars. Okay, we're on Trail of the Cedars. This is something that Scott and I have been wanting to do for a long time and it's so cool to finally be here. It's easy access, there's a waterfall at the end. There's wheelchair access here too. We can't wait to see it, let's keep going. This scenic path winds us through a stunning cedar forest alongside the beautiful Avalanche Creek with its pristine waters. Now here's the disappointing plot twist. My camera decided to have a meltdown it decided to wipe out all of the remaining footage for the day. Can you believe it? We had so much in store for you. From Scott munching on a bison burger to savouring the famous huckleberry pie. But Scott managed to capture some breathtaking moments on his phone and we'll share them with you so you won't miss the beauty we witnessed. We hope these snippets will ignite your wanderlust and place Glacier National Park at the top of your bucket list. To wrap up this whirlwind of a day, just outside the park, Scott launched his trusty drone, capturing stunning aerial shots of the Flathead River. Relax and enjoy this beautiful part of Montana. Thank you for sticking with us during this episode. We will be back next week with another episode as we continue our journey through Montana. Until then, thanks for your support and look after your mates. <laughs>